I'm Trudy, and this is Ava, and we are reading for Cancer yes. for the month of July 2013. Yes. We'll be reading a four-card spread. The first card is the general environment Absolutely. of the month of July. Uh -huh. So there we have the Six of Wands inverted. Six of Wands is a great card when it's in the upright. It's about going public. This is about not going public, and yeah. it can be... Uh, Keeping something private for yeah. a while. Keeping it close to your, your breast. Mm -hmm. For a while, whatever uh, it is, the new something that you want to present to the public, to to people that you know, either uh -huh. your small public, that is your family, uh -huh. immediate family, friends, uh -huh. or general public, yeah, you know, out in, out in the world, not sharing, and it could be about not maybe sharing, getting off Facebook. Who knows? Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Stay away from. They're you know, watching privacy. you. <laughs> privacy is an issue, and it could be an a issue for you issue. this month. Yes. Okay. Next card would be challenges faced this month, and we have the Eight of Pentacles. Pentacles being a card of the material, of money, of pragmatic things. Meeting your challenges, meeting, uh, applying your skill um, to whatever skills that you have in order to make all your bills, all your, your um, payments, to keep everything in check and balanced. Mm -hmm. And applying yourself. Um, to very pragmatic, practical issues concerning that. Right, and that is the obstacle, but doing it for yourself as well, because the Eight of Pentacles is about learning new things mm -hmm. for your um, the fulfillment of oneself. Yes. So that's an obstacle. Maybe you're not finding time to do the things that you want to do, but take time and, um, you know, keep it private. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. Don't do it on Facebook. Oh my, and so now we have the High Priestess inverted. In the unexpected um, position. High Priestess is the second of the Major Arcana cards, right after the Fool. Right, and it generally has to do with paying attention to your intuition, into those inspirations, into those things that you know to be true inside. Um, but what's unexpected is that perhaps some way you are uh, informed intuitively and maybe you're not paying attention. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not paying attention to your own intuition. It's kind of interesting because you're keeping something private this month. Yes. There's some issue that is close to the vest which you're not sharing. Mm -hmm. And maybe by not checking in or understanding what that intuition is, we're not able to share. So there's some sort of blockage here yeah, with an issue this month. Yes, there's something, in, so far two of these cards mean that there's something internal going on that you are um, having to be secretive about mm -hmm. and not wanting to really pay attention to it as much as you should. You mm -hmm. should pay attention to this, this whole uh, internal uh, churning that's happening to you this month. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's kind of a very, yeah, it's a very introspective month. Introspective. For cancer. Yes. It's kind of making me nervous. Yes. <laughs> let's, see what, let's see what happens. Glad I'm not a cancer. <laughs> All right, so we have oh, yes. forthcoming. All right, so we have the Queen of Swords inverted. And this would be a major event that's coming up this month. Queen of Swords is the, the queen of the intellect. Um, she's the queen who says it like it is, and this is the inverted, very blunt queen. Um, she's inverted. Yes. yes. Very blunt. Um, so there seems cutting. The cross purposes here is that you want very much to express yourself, mm -hmm. to tell it like it is, and to be as honest and truthful as you can be, just off the cuff, but you can't. Mm -hmm. And again, it goes back to the, the this idea that you have to keep something to yourself, mm -hmm. and you're not willing also to really examine all of that as uh, deeply as you ought to be. Mm -hmm. And so, what you're doing is you're immersing yourself in work, and uh, allowing that to be uh, your challenge. You're you're kind of focusing there as opposed to letting work be what it ought to be, which is just a, a means by which you uh, establish yourself in the world, uh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, survive, all the positive aspects of it, which you are, 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 are sort of, all your energy is being 
drained or, or focused in on your work as opposed to all these other phenomena. A lot of things being ignored in this reading. Yes. And it, it may be that at some point you're going to have to take a look at what's going on deep down inside. Yes. Because it's going to come I out eventually. This month is the month to do that. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's going to come out it's eventually. presenting you with opportunities for that. Yeah, you don't want to just erupt, which no, is basically don't what just we see ignore it all swords. and yeah. do, do your tasks, yeah. do what needs to be done. Don't do that. Yeah. Instead, go inside. Pay attention. Pay attention. And this is the month to do that. It's July. Yes. Go out and read a book in the sun and enjoy cancer. Yeah. See you next time. See you next time.